Hello, my name is Haley Stone. I'm a 16-year-old student from North Alfred, Saskatchewan, representing Mosquito Grizzly Bearhead Lean Man First Nation. Hello everyone, my name is Siobhan Cadigan and I'm a 14-year-old youth from Downeyville, Ontario. Hi, good afternoon. My name is Kagan Beardy. I'm 18. I'm from Thunder Bay, Ontario, representing 19. I had my birthday a few days ago. And <laughs> And I am representing Deer Lake First Nation, Ontario. Uh, throughout the Canada We Want Conference, we address some common issues in Canada, as well as how the national youth policy can help, uh, elevate, the help elevate the living quality of young Canadians and uh, students in Canada. Um, can I have my notes again? <laughs> oh yeah, it's, 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 it's right here. <laughs> yeah. Oh yeah, our, our youth policy theme group basically, uh, our youth policy and action theme group and co had conversations revolving around four main topics, government transparency and accountability, regional specific approaches, and increased access to quality opportunities and improving avenues for youth addressing the, dis and, and, and improving the avenues for youth addressing the disconnection between youth and educational institutions. The change of action we hope to see is an ever-changing timeline of projects and initiatives that drive the youth policy forward. It should be easily navigated and accessible, all through a digital interface. We can improve the quality of current opportunities provided to youth by making them specific to their region, such as transportation, survival skill learning, mental health services, cultural services, and cultural learning. This will increase the health and support for all youth across Canada. We want equitable funding to measure the implementation of youth policy that is constant across all regions in Canada. We want mandatory recognition of the strategies that follow the mandate of the national youth policy inside municipal government by forming a regional committee that has direct access to decision makers we can effect effectively measure the implementation of the youth policy. We want increased diversity of youth voice involved on the Board of Education with at least two student representatives. This allows youth to be heard and to have a voice in their education. We call on you to recognize the youth policy in meetings, conferences, and other important events to ensure that these issues are resolved and how our society can do better. The importance of the youth policy is very significant and in, can impact the next generations. By putting these actions into young people's communities, we can create a country where all youth feel accepted and connected to their regions. The Canada, the Canada we, we want is one, one where the youth policy is recognized and put to action now. now.